Oh my god. If you um, if he would have skidded any closer, that would have been right in I my nose would be right up. <laughs> Her right up. <laughs> yes. Poor Miley. Why well, were you sticking your bum in Louis' face? I was sticking it right up his face. <laughs> what are we doing today? Keep your hand behind when you're using them. Okay. No, too close. That's it. Look what it says, my stick. We cut these sticks. One will come out here. Uh, I think they're just below sticks. Put a bit of copper at the bottom for wear. And I've cut around the edge, and as you can see, it makes a great handle for walking. Don't we, Louie? We always cut these sticks. Yeah. Let me see your stick. Show them your stick. And I say, Louie's got the same bit of copper at the bottom, and he's got a wee bit where he's sawing the top, do you see it? All around the top, and it makes it smooth on your hand, doesn't it? Yeah. When you're walking. Do you like them sticks? Yes. Cause what does that, what do you use it for whenever you're walking? Where does it help you? Getting over walls steep. or steep hills yeah. or going down over ditches. Yes. Louis, hands away from the knife. Yeah, good boy. One of the best saws that you can get, I think, on Amazon or what I've found when I'm out walking and stuff, or if a tree falls and people are carrying saws and stuff, is this. It's a, a blade and it just simply closes like that you can carry it in your pocket now it looks big it's not that big it's about the size of your arm from your elbow down to your hand and um it's a great bit of kit you know and it, it cuts through it cuts through branches with real ease so what was that 30 seconds like leaves a nice fresh cut but i I definitely get one of these here. They're better than any saw or any knife or anything. Isn't that right, Louie? Haven't you got one? Yes. One of the things <laughs> that we enjoy is cutting the ivy, don't we, Louie? Because it, what does the ivy do, Louie? Strangle, it's, it strangles the trees, doesn't it? This is one, oh. one we cut earlier, a couple of weeks ago, actually. And look, look at it coming off. <laughs> look at the nice tree underneath. But yeah, so we cut that with the knife. And now it's dying, as you can see. That dog, she just loves sticks. Don't you, Baba? She just loves her sticks. Here we go. Here we go. One. <laughs> That's the tree that we cut the ivy off, didn't we, Louie? So you can see where we've cut it. Here. And there. So it stopped the growth from going to the top. And you can see the actual ivy now. It's starting to... It's a couple of weeks old. It's starting to die. That dog's mad. We like to cut the ivy, don't we, Louie? Because it strangles the tree, doesn't it? So we get the knife, which I tell you, get the, it's the best knife about or saw. It's a hand saw. What do you hear it cracking? Look, that cracked, and uh, it just shows you. Is it? We're going to cut the ivy on this with your saw? Yep, but okay. this is actually his saw. Okay. And I'm saw? Louie. Hi, Louie. Right, Louie, go ahead. No. Oh, he's going well. He's going really well. He needs to hold it a bit tighter and down in that way. Now, go ahead, level with it, that's it. Oh, it's going to snap, Louie. It's doing a great job, Louie. A wee bit more than you there. Yes! <laughs> Did it snap? No, it didn't. But still, look at look at it, the way it strangles the tree. Let's cut this bit. 
That's a wee bit. That's colder. Okay. Very good, Louie. <laughs> Was that the easier bit? So, Louie, don't we use these for? What do we use these straight bits for? See, look, see the way they're straight? Yeah. See how straight they are? Yeah. We use them for arrows, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, so we cut them to bottom and they're really straight and you can use them for arrows. And leaving you, what would you say? No, you wouldn't see the car's only down there. So we've nearly cut all the ivy. Where is there any more ivy, Louis, that's strangling the trees? See that one there that we've cut? Look at that one, Louis, on the big one. See it? That was strangling that tree. Yeah. And now it's cut. Isn't that right, Louis? You like cutting, don't you? And he's sharpening his stick. But he's keeping his. Ah. Uh, up the way, never towards your hand. That's it. Very good. Oh, go on, Baba. Go on. Is it Mr. Fox or Mr. Rabbit? There's probably tadpoles in there. Miley, get out of that. She is wild for swimming. Go on, Baba, go on. Go on, Louie. I heard something. Oh, a big bridge. What are we looking at? We're looking at the trees. Look so the trees are blowing in the wind. If you just stir at the trees. Looks like they're walking. Does it? They're going, I might tell you what, Louie. I wouldn't like to be at the top of them trees. Would you like to be at the top of them trees? Nope. No way. Why? You'd be, you'd be flying like a, I don't know what, you'd be flying about like you would. It would be fun. It would be like the fun fair. Come on, hello. <laughs> I cut a bit of ivy by myself. Oh, did you cut this bit? Will I take it out? Yes. Oh. <laughs> You've saved the tree, Louie. Yeah. Come on, Come on Baba. Where's Hi, the mouse? Morning, big Miley. Come on, girl. Morning, Good girl. See all the bluebells are starting to come up. See all the, they're all bluebells, all them. It's not lovely up ahead. The forest is lovely at this time of year, isn't it? She's a real cheeky bitch. Miley went away there on us for a good 10 minutes, didn't we? We couldn't get her. We were whistling and whistling and she still wouldn't come back. And then she eventually showed her head up and she knew she'd done wrong. She sat in her bum, didn't she? She was very cheeky. Huh? Weren't you? Very cheeky you indeed. And you fell? Yes. <laughs> you maybe you will fall now. Oh! <laughs> what did happen to me up there? You lost my leg. And what else happened to me? You fell. <laughs> I fell on my ass, so I did. And he finds it really. He's a bulldog, aren't you, Baba? Yeah. What have you got? Where's the mouse? Where's the mouse? Look, 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 look. Do you hear the birdies? Hear the birds? Because you're whistling. It knows that we're around. Is it sending an alarm call to all the rest of the birds? Is that what it's doing? Yeah, because you're shouting and the whistling. <laughs> what were you doing, Baba? We were shooting. So that's the stick that was made. Grandpa, let's. Did you spit there? Yeah, I did. <laughs> because, because the stick so the stick is, is in that shape, so Grandpa. we cut it below it one minute. So we cut it below it, and then it's straight, and it's up to your waist. You bring it up to the side of your waist to measure it, and then you have a nice stick, a nice walking stick. Louis, show everybody your walking stick, and the way it's got a handle. See the way it's got a handle? Yeah. Look at my, he's looking for a stick. So, yeah, after you sand it down, which I do, sand all this down, and sand that, but I leave that bit of bark just for decoration, and then, as you can see, 
sand this down for him and a bit of harness and it looks lovely. We, we done them names when we were four. No, it was when was I, it not two? No, when I was four we done When you were four. And what did you come on show me where it was that you done? What did you do? We D carved our names. Oh. Oh. So I'm sure the people want to see your name. Where is it? Oh, and what what does L what does LC stand for? Louis Cassidy. Oh, and you done that when you were four? Yeah. Jeez, you're brilliant, man. And uh, there's another one. Who's LC? Me. That's another LC. Once again. You're a bit of a graffiti artist, aren't you? <laughs> hey, everyone. Thank you, Louie. <laughs> Spreading your germs. Thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed it. And also, Miley's enjoying her little treat. Aren't you, Miley? <laughs> <laughs>